Officers respond. Witness report of an active drug deal. Reported location is near Midtown North. Over. Civilians are trapped in their vehicles following a severe accident. And now for listener emails. May from Queens writes, You're so full of anger and I wish you'd get help managing it. It's terrible for your health. Now I know she speaks from a place of concern, but this is a common misconception that I have to correct. I'm not full of anger. I'm full of love. I call out injustice, corruption, and crimes against humanity because... I adore this city, and I want it to be better. What you hear in my voice is nothing but love. Mugging reported. Need an officer on the scene. Hi, Herman. Seriously? Give it up! You're never gonna catch me! That's what you said last time. I don't wanna hurt you! You'll just slow me down! Wow, that's considerate. What's the money for, Herman? Why do you care? Actually, I don't. Just trying to make polite conversation. I'm done talking! But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level! Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Come on, Herman! At least talk to me so we can make it interesting! Herman? What? Do you only answer to Shocker now? Mr. Shocker? are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. Good enough. Move, move, move!
gotta hurry. to keep up. Zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? <laughs> Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah. He was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm Max. Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Lord, I thank you for this food and this plate. Peter, what can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. She wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where'd she find it? I'm really not sure. Why, what is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, 
Makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. I could patch these shoes. They'll last a while yet. Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. dangerous oh it's just a story mary jane's investigating don't worry i'll make sure she's careful please tell me you two are back together we're talking again baby steps i hope i didn't upset mr lee he's just concerned i was actually touched by how concerned i knew he liked you he admires how dedicated you are to helping others i think you remind him of himself when he was younger both orphans both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Hello? Peter. Dr. Octavia. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I didn't forget, forget, I just, uh, I'll be there soon. <sighs> this tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker, you're better than this. <sighs> He's right. How did I lose track of time?
How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes! <laughs> hey! Hey! What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment at Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. They, they, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. I wish I could do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. I should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Left me a message about these before he left for you. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is too. Well, it's not gonna pay the bills, but. It sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. I've got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the, oh, what's the word, contaminants before they reach toxic levels. Between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting. The amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high. 
and rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. For these clouds to be visible to the naked eye, the level of toxins must be up there. And gotcha! I'm getting some good stuff. Well, good samples of bad stuff, anyway. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it feels like I'm breathing from a tailpipe. <laughs> I must be freaking these people out. Now what else is new? Huh. The toxin's coming from two types of cars, and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. Fighting the good fight. Can I get an autograph? Hey, stitching on that costume's pretty good. Maxie! Hey, I've Maxie! Great light on that one. Perfect. I saw the fish kick down on TV. The way you jumped through that window. Wow. Just, just wow. Oh, my God. Oh, 
Excuse me. Best smokestack picture I ever took. Well, Harry Station just stopped a public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Spider-Man, Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was. But one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. Attention units. Report received of a narcotic sale in progress. Reported location is Murray Hill. I've been looking into the demons. Sounds like they've quietly established a power base in the vacuum left by Fisk. A vacuum I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. But what were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman actually, pulled our funding. Oh, Pete. I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some... Herman! Long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but, uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa! Your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid, you just stupid. You talk so much! Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio of talking versus not talking? Also, how would you measure? Words per minute, syllables per second, or is it more about how many words one uses to express a single thought? Okay, now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because if I don't, they'll kill me! If you ask nicely, maybe. Gotcha. 
coming your way! If you come clean, I can help you! You really want to help me? Just let me have the money! Sorry, not gonna happen! Quit now, for your own good! <laughs> anymore. You're lucky you found natural cash. If you really want to rob banks, try day trading. It's all the rage. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no! Oh, come on, Herman. If you tell me who you're working for, I can help you cut a deal. Die off! I'm dead! They made that very clear! yourself literally man he was scared and desperate these demons are everywhere all of a sudden okay Yuri shocker's all yours now good work we have a special cell waiting for him at the raft We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, 
The Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on demon, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. The fight with Shocker took a while. Time to catch up on what I've been missing out in the city. Sorry about that, MJ. I was just gonna say, I think I'm unemployed. Norman pulled our funding. Oh, Pete, I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some sense into his dad. You'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. reports of demons. I knew you'd come around. They've been pretty busy tonight, hitting a lot of Fisk properties. They're going after Fisk? Damn. You thinking what I'm thinking? Brewing gang war? Let's try to get ahead of it. Are there any Fisk properties that haven't been hit tonight? Let me see. Patrol reported a bunch of activity at one of his shipyards in Portside. Thanks, Yuri. I'll check it out. idea what Fisk uses that shipyard for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. His name's Jefferson Davis. That's his beat. He's a good cop. Been working the Fisk case for years. If anyone knows what's going on at that shipyard, it's him. We got this Spider-Man, thanks anyway.
one toe inside the vault, I'll have your head. Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup, but that don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check, Eagle 2, you up? Eagle 2 reporting in. Eyes on. What caches are the demons after? Need to take out Fisk's men and figure out what they're guarding. Whatever it is, I don't want it in Fisk's or the demons' hands. Snipers everywhere. Might need to deal with them first. That sniper has a guard watching him. May need to divide and conquer. Wait, how come we're just focusing on the vault? Doesn't the boss have gear stashed all over? It did. Demons have been hidden other locations. A lot of junk scattered around here. A well-placed web shot could make a great distraction. They keep talking about gear. What does Fisk store here? Guards are clustered together. Web shot on the right object could draw them away. Naming on a package of stuff's confusing. We got Z23, CR17, and D12. CR20. Crap, I don't have numbers, just names. Shaped charges, detonator caps, blasting gel. Well, I can't tell what's what while it's still packaged. Can we just screw him into it? Oh, crap. Hey, there's webs over here. It's gotta be Spider-Man. Yo, give me some cover.
right, Frank. Fall asleep on us? Frank! Oh, crap. Did someone check on him? They're checking his last position. If I was you, I wouldn't want to fight me either. You sleep it off. I literally didn't see that coming. No, we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Any place this rundown should have a hole in the wall or a broken window. Check around back. I'd go myself, but you know, not Spider-Man. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Hello? Any fishermen with a grudge and a hook for a hand? Okay, where's that locked door?
Jeff, you there? I'm doing my best to refrain from knock-knock jokes. Appreciate it. You see a junction box powering the door? Yeah, got it. If we can overload it, that should force the door open. Smart, but I don't have anything that packs enough current. Try this. Stun gun, genius. Capacitors in this are just what I need for an upgrade I've been thinking of. Web for the win. A gadget man, huh? You remind me of my son. Started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. <laughs> Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Those guys love their hidden rooms. Check it out. I could have unlocked this myself. Hey, I doubt I would have found it without you. Hmm. I got a big fat nothing. Well, there's one secret room that could be more. Notice anything about the floor? Uh -huh. They can hide the doors, but not the scrapes they leave. Keep an eye out for more of those. I know I'm after scrapes. I should take another look around. Found a scrape. Oh. I guess normal doors don't count, huh? Good guess. Where else could there be scrapes? Any luck? Yeah, my usual kind. Bad. Look for out-of-place scrapes on any surface. Floors, walls. Gotta check all the walls and floors for scrapes. There must be scrapes I'm not seeing somewhere.
Scrapes, right. Pay dirt! Scrape, no door. None I can see, anyway. Sit tight, I'll pull you up. I can use a little help with the elevator. Right, I'm on it. Second floor, rusted machine parts, big honkin' rats. <laughs> Careful, the bridge is out. I got this one. <clears throat> nice, stuck the landing and everything. We're not all donut eaters. <laughs> Fair enough. Another secret door. I'll rig the lock. Let me know if you find the junction box. Yep, on it. Fisk for a long time, huh? He's my great white whale. Did that work? Nah. Must not be the right box. Keep looking. If I were a junction box, where would I be? Follow the conduit. They should lead you in the right direction. I'm starting to wonder if this shipyard was ever legit. Can't be that many places to hide a junction box. Did it open? A lot of guys around Fist to steer mysteriously. Maybe this is where they end up. Thanks. I wasn't thinking about finding dead bodies until you said that, and now I can't stop. <laughs> Found one. Nailed it. Hey, check this out. Nothing. I'm starting to feel like this is Fisk's way of messing with me. But look at the walls. They kept guns here. They wouldn't have moved them to the front door. Gotta be a passageway we're missing. Check out the wall. This might control access to another area. Fisk's men were talking about a vault. Maybe we're close. Bet on it. Looks like a dual circuit. See if you can find a second junction box. Found it. Yeah. Ah! 
clear. You were right, Jeff. Trap door. Outstanding. Think you can help me out? This thing's heavy. One, two, three. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. I can't get through. Let me see how it looks from the top. Got room to maneuver here. Hang on. I'm blocked. Anything you can do? What was that? Subway, maybe. Let's hustle. Place is unstable. Okay, that definitely wasn't a subway. No. Sounded like explosives. And that sounds like demons. The vault! Hurry! Demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an armory. Or was. Smash and grab. They were moving fast. Got empty crates here. And it looks like they took the ones they didn't clean out. There. They blew the locks to get in. There's a fenced-off room here they didn't bother with. Too much effort to break in when you can just peel back the wire mesh over this gun rack. Firing! Stay clear! 
One of your tricks would be great about now. Trucks full of gunmen in one day. It's time to hang up the webs. Better. These guys are all over the road. They'll kill someone if I can't stop them. Doing my best to catch up, but you might be on your own. Stay safe, Jeff. Don't do anything crazy. Bystanders will get shot. I gotta get in close. Hey guys, room for one more? Starting to think I'm not wanted. I'm losing them. Too far ahead. They're getting too far ahead. No see.
Now the three decides to run on time. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your angle? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Up in. She's good. Man, I'm beat. Time to head home and get some sleep. Come on. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's Route 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? <sighs> Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage, Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. I don't care if I lose everything else, but I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck? I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. Of course it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage.
Maybe there's another way in. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great, I'm headed there now. shot but sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off really i'll check out the pizza shops any idea which one one of the mom and pop joints i think jerry's no that's uptown i mean original jerry's oh right no started with an l i think larry's that's on the east side uh leo's leo's yeah that might be it man i love leo's i'll pick you up a pie I owe you one. No worries. Hope you find what you're looking for. Thanks, Eddie. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. Move it, spider jerk! Don't got time for you! No sign of my stuff. <laughs> what an interesting smell. Eddie, my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. 
There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh, looks like trouble. Okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. Please be here. Yes! Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey look, an old gadget prototype. Looks kinda awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Uh, I think I can make this work. Got it. Look, is that guy Spider-Man? Uh oh. Ice him. What is that? They move so fast. Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. Talk my way onto MJ's couch. Let's see. Uh, hi, MJ. It's Peter. Any chance I could stay over? To oh, that's too formal. MJ.
MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and... Ah, oh, that's lame! Hey, MJ. Now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... I... Okay, that just sounds pathetic! Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Hmm, someone left me a voicemail. Number's blocked, though. Hey there, spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice. All units. Officers are under fire from mass hostiles. Incident is ongoing in the West Village. Doc left a message. Peter, I might have been a bit hasty advising you to find another job. I have a plan. Give me a bit of time. We may yet live to invent another day. The indomitable Otto Octavius. That's great news. Hope his plan works. Hello, Spider. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. Black Cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? She wants me to find something. Need to look harder. Gotta be some kind of clue. There. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out.
Hey, Yuri. You still have Black Cat suit and equipment. the evidence lockup, right? I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were gonna meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter, I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. Believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. <sighs> What's this world coming to? Hey, kid, what are you doing here at this hour? Just dropping in. What are you doing here so late? Hope May's couch is comfortable. I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay?
he decides to run on time. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Hop in. She's good. Man, I'm beat. Time to head home and get some sleep. Come on. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, six four four seven six. That's Route Thirty Three. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? <sighs> Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage, Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. care if I lose everything else, but I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck? I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. Of course it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe 
there's another way in. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great, I'm headed there now. shot but sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off really i'll check out the pizza shops any idea which one one of the mom and pop joints i think jerry's no that's uptown i mean original jerry's oh right no started with an l i think larry's that's on the east side uh leo's leo's yeah that might be it man i love leo's i'll pick you up a pie I owe you one. No worries. Hope you find what you're looking for. Thanks, Eddie. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. Moving, spider jerk! Don't got time for you! No sign of my stuff. <coughs> what an interesting smell. Eddie, my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. 
There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh, looks like trouble. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. Please be here, please be here. Yes. Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look, an old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? I think I can make this work. Got it. Look, is that guy? It's a spider. Uh oh. Ice him. What is that? Something moves so fast. Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. How am I going to talk my way onto MJ's couch? Let's see. Uh, hi MJ, it's Peter. Any chance I could stay over? Oh, that's too formal. MJ!
MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and... Ah, oh, that's lame! Hey, MJ. Now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... Okay, that just sounds pathetic! Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Uh, what am I thinking? Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Hmm, someone left me a voicemail. Number's blocked, though. Hey there, spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice. All units. Officers are under fire from masked hostiles. Incident is ongoing in the West Village. Doc left a message. Peter, I might have been a bit hasty advising you to find another job. I have a plan. Give me a bit of time. We may yet live to invent another day. The indomitable Otto Octavius. That's great news. Hope his plan works. Hello, Spider. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. Black Cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? She wants me to find something. Need to look harder. Gotta be some kind of clue. There. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out.
Hey, Yuri. You still have Black Cat's suit and equipment. the evidence lockup, right? I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were gonna meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter, I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Well, of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. This hour. Just dropping in. What are you doing here so late? Hope May's couch is comfortable. I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay?